Good morning, guys. So uh, we're up here, Lee and I. Um, we're waiting on our welder, our portable welder guy. He's supposed to be coming. We took uh, Ashton's truck, which has the fire wagon in it, because you know we can't combine without a fire wagon. Um, we wet it underneath all the combine. We wet it back and behind here because we're going to be welding uh, right on this bracket. Uh, we did not wet down our electronics. We're just trying to make sure we don't start the combine on fire while wilding on the combine. And our welder is Brad and he is nearly here. Actually, Lee, uh, we should probably pull out this ground. Yeah, we gotta disconnect the ground first. That looks like a 15 maybe. I got tools in the combine. See anything down here? It seems to be going out where we dump the pit, so that's good. Hate to burn down another combine, though the last one wasn't our fault. Definitely smell the paint burning off this puppy. I would in here. Nothing, no surprises. It's right in there is where all the sparks are fine. That's where we want to watch. See that chaff in there? We soaked it all down with water. We disconnect the batteries to make sure we don't burn out any of our ACUs or ECUs or BBCUs or MCUs, <laughs> anything with the C and the U. Don't look into the light, you guys. Don't look into the light. Hard on your eyes. We got one inside. Yeah, we spotted one fire and we're putting it out right here. Yep, good me off. Right there on that rubber. Yeah. No, it was actually on fire. Right there. Yeah, yeah you can keep going. We're cooling yeah. it. Yeah, we got water on it. Yeah, we're good. Feel good, Brad. Throw some water in and around those sieves. I see some smoke coming out the bottom of the sieves. Shake it around in there. See the, yeah. It's just the heat burning through the other side of the steel is the problem. And then uh, this rubber belting on the sieve and the rubberness started that on fire. No big deal, it's small. We just put it out. It sucks to weld on combines, you guys, just due to all the chaff around. It doesn't take much to uh, light something up. We'll keep an eye for other areas here. Down in here, everything looks okay. Well, we are got it all back together. Um, let's weld it on. The welds are questionable, I guess you could say, but it will definitely do for what we got to get done here. It's probably gonna have to be some updating done by ACO for that mount. Um, like I said, this isn't the first time we've welded on these combines. This, last year, remember, we did a video welding on Ashton's combine on the other side. So it's a fairly common thing. But I think we're good to go. We don't have much left here. We only have like another day or so of combining and we're done. So we're going to get cracking. Right, Lee? We're going to get cracking. Oh, yeah. We're going to do big things. We're going to do big things. Let's give this a whirly bird. 
We got everything hooked back up. Let's see if we fried any U's. ECU's, MCU's, BBU's, TTU's, ZZU's, and Zebra's, and everything else. <sighs> oh. I like to wait to power up the monitors, and then we'll give it a, give it a start here. Hey, Lee. Yeah. Oh, don't, don't give me that pause. I don't want an awkward pause. I'm just kidding. I just wanted to. Oh. That's one thing I do like about the deer. At least you get the. <laughs> you know, there's some life in it. Okay, we're going to give it a start. Awesome. Birds like a kitten. We are good to go. All right, we're just doing a run test. We actually have the rotors and everything going. There's no knocking, everything sounds good. He's checking for everything. Lee's out there running around. Ashton has just arrived. She's gonna hop on the combine. Let's idle her up here a little more. It's not like it's a race or anything between your your dad. He'll Absolutely. Be he'll be done today, I think, so. We have to help him. <laughs> oh, you want to go help him? I'm saying he's going to have to come help us, but uh, no, I think we're going to finish very similar time, I hope. Hopefully no one has to help anyone. That's right. We'll all finish at the same time and then we'll go up the Okie dokie, so we uh, literally made two passes here. Like that's how much canola we got in our hopper. And yes, it's dirty because it always is dirty when you when you just shut the sieves off and the combine off. But uh, we stopped because this bubble up auger is kinda making a bit of a ruckus. And what the problem is, is the U-joint, hold on here, is about I do believe that U joint is about crookled. Now we're gonna keep going with it. She's gonna have to bring a whole new U joint out. I'm gonna go until it implodes on itself, I guess, because we are sick of being down. We've been down for a long time. We we're down all day yesterday. We're gonna keep going. And we're gonna make some phone calls so that way we can get a new, whole new U joint assembly and everything uh, brought out to us here. Hopefully it lasts long enough until they get out with a new one. That's the goal. All right, back on the road here. I guess we're not finishing. Oh, we'll finish. It's gonna, <laughs> it's gonna hold together. The cases are coming in for backup. <laughs> we got recruitments. I'm just gonna step outside like I normally do. Oh, don't stop back. <laughs>
all the crop? Yeah, I know the spots are a little, well, thin here, a little sad. We got a door if I wanted to. You know, this is why you want that shield on the front. Cause that cold will stand up there later on. Tell out it's going in a bigger bed. Why you want to be able to control the speed of your pickup belt? Pretty sad looking swabs.
think we're gonna keep cutting. I and myself am gonna go spraying. Ash is gonna cut, I guess, or pick up. I'm not used to saying picking up cloths. I would think full on's gonna come back down. And Lee is gonna haul some canola away. That's when I should have started. No. Showing all the reality of it. I just show all the reality, that's right. The good, the bad you get some good it. stuff in this low spot and you get the majority of man I'm I gotta put my seatbelt. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> safety first around this camp. Always safety first. Always. Alright hon, I'm out of here. So you gonna stop for me or you want me to get on the go? Oh, thank you! See you later. All right, guys. I'm going spraying. She's going combine. Lee is going to do some grain carting and haul some grain. Because I want to spray all this. Because look at it. It's just a, this is a weed disaster out here. If 10 is the worst, this is a 9.8. So, adios.